62-year-old Ted Sander takes medicine for his high blood pressure. I'm becoming more conscious of, of what I should and shouldn't be eating. Sander looks over his soybean crop that may one day improve the health of people like himself. University of Missouri scientists are growing soybeans to make a vegetable oil without trans fats. It'll be a premium oil. They can fry with it and they can be assured that they'll have a heart healthy oil. And it'll be a lot like olive oil. Olive oil is high in oleic acid. Current soybean oil must undergo a process called hydrogenation so it doesn't spoil. But this creates trans fats, which are not good for your heart. Through natural soybean breeding, scientists at the MU Delta Research Center are producing soybeans that avoid this unhealthy process. These seeds will be in high demand. The beans are very high in oleic acid, up to 80 percent. This makes the oil stable with a good shelf life and lowers the saturated fat by 25 percent. We know that it'll bring along its already known good features and then by changing the oil profile it has the ability to uh, enhance heart health. Emmy researchers say people don't realize how much soybean oil is in their diet. Healthier cookies and even healthier french fries could be just around the corner. If we can find a way to improve the health and stability of a food ingredient without people having to make any changes in their lives, we can potentially improve the health of all consumers. The goal now is to put the high oleic trade in soybeans that produce high yields. EMU scientists say it will take about three years. It's still a good oil. We just made it better. From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting.